This is our entryway, come on in. First thing you see when you come in is what we call our Disney room. It's our bonus front room here. You can use it for a den. You can use it as a hangout room, another little TV room for the kids. We just send the kids over there. But also in this room, we have a barn door that was made. Stay right there. Slaters. Just like that. Custom made barn door that was put in here. So, to your right, if you gotta use the commode, there it is. Somebody did not close the lid. Come on. Come on. Then you walk into our great room here. This is our family space here. So we got the full kitchen with the bar, granite countertops everywhere, lots of cabinet space, lots of room. You got the family dining table right here in the midst of everything. And then we got our living room right here with the brand new fireplace that was just made. I'm so sad because I don't want to leave it. And look at, check this out. All done with a remote control. That's it. You just sit there and you can click it on, click it off. You don't have to sit there, you ain't got to chop wood. On the sides here of this custom fireplace, we have these nice white oak bookshelves, built in on both sides of it. So plenty of seating for the whole family. That's right. <laughs> Come on over here, I'll take you upstairs. And then we're gonna check out the backyard. Somebody should close that front door though, huh? We got coming upstairs. Lots of space, you look up right here. You can see everything. Also when you look down too, it's kind of nice. So coming up the stairs, get a little break in the middle there. Got all the rooms around here. Let's, uh, let's go this way. First way to the girls room over here. So of course this room could be anything. Great size room. Obviously you see we have a big, large bunk bed in here. Double closets over here. So if you got, like we have little girls, but you got teenage girls, you got lots of clothes, two closets available in here. Right next door is their bathroom. So it's the upstairs bathroom, double sink, shower, and the toilet. And one thing that my wife had to have was the washroom upstairs, of course. So there's the washroom upstairs. And the cool thing about it, granite countertops once again, and you have cabinetry. Not only do you have cabinetry around, but you have closet space, more closet space. Oh, don't look in there. You don't want to see that. Don't look in there. Never know what's in there. I don't even know what's in there. I never go in there. Over here to our right, we have another bedroom. Another bedroom. We're using this as kind of our school room uh, right now because our girls are homeschooled. So they have their desk set up over here. My oldest and my middle one. So they're nine and six. But this would be a, a great bedroom for somebody. There's um, closet space here. This used to be our guest room in this space right here. So lots of space to happen right there. And then let's head all the way over to the back of the hallway over here. And you notice you can look down over the railing here. Hello. And then you come back to our back room. And this is kind of our extra room for us, but it could be another bedroom for another kid. Uh, maybe that college kid that, she, that came back home and you know, they have nowhere to go. You can put them in here. Put them in the corner, okay? <laughs> they got their own closet and everything. And they can lean over the balcony. Then you go to the master bedroom right here. Double doors into the master bedroom. It's a sweet master bedroom, lots of space. Vaulted ceilings in this room. As well in the, the front bedroom, that's a large bedroom. Vaulted ceilings in that room as well. So, and it leads into the master bath, which is right over here. We have uh, double sinks once again. It's the higher counter and it's granite. The sunken tub. So you have that. We got a shower, standing shower. There's the little commode right there so you can lock yourself away. And, uh, and then we have a decent closet here that we've uh, made the best out of every uh, inch in this closet. So, I mean, there's ways that you can make room by shoe racks and everything else like that. So, um, got lots and lots and lots and lots of stuff happening in there. So some custom stuff that we've done to the house. Um, I'm going to take you back in the backyard is what I'm going to do. The backyard. So we're going to head back downstairs and um, show you around in the backyard. So 
let's see. Downstairs, what's recently been done is we repainted the entire downstairs with a semi-gloss so that way it's wipeable because we got kids. We did the new LVP floor, which is a Coralux. It's an eight millimeter floor with a 20 mil layer on top where this has a lifetime warranty and it has 100% waterproof. We got it for our girls and because we have a little doggy and also the fireplace that was all custom done um, with uh, the gas fireplace with remote control, all of that built out. So we also have custom light fixtures in here that we've installed. And if you don't, if that's not your jam and you don't like that style, we got plenty of styles that we can put in for you. Let's check out the backyard. Here's our outdoor space. And back here, right when we came in, we spent a little bit of money to get the concrete put in. Um, and uh, well, not just a little bit, but quite a bit. So got green grass out here. Um, you got a full patio that has been stained and stamped. Um, you got storage on both sides and there's concrete on both sides of the house that we had done, all stained and stamped concrete. So we've had 50 people in the backyard before hanging out with us and barbecuing and everything else like that. So there's plenty of space back here to have an event, having a party, an indoor, outdoor space. And you come on back in, we got a pantry over there, lots of stuff happening, lots of things going on. We got storage on both sides into the garage. The garage has a two and a half garage, so it's a two car garage and it's not a full tandem, but it has an inset so you can put all of your Christmas decorations or whatever else you got going on, you can throw in there and be a part of that. And we're back to the front door. That's 2,200 square feet, 2,244 to be exact. And we're at the Elderberry on the Bluff. It's a gated community off of Herndon and 99. The new shopping center, marketplace center is right across the street where the Target is. They're building actually new restaurants and a movie theater, the first uh, luxury movie theater in the Central Valley. So if you like this house, you can contact us uh, with all the information below. We'd love to show you it in person. Thanks so much. Now get out.